Today we're going to be making a paper sculpture inspired by the artist Frank Stella. We'll start by using a marker to create free form lines across our paper. Next, we'll add lines and patterns in each of the shapes we've created. You can use markers, crayons, color pencils, or whatever coloring tools you have. Try to use all the different types of lines we've learned about to create an artwork inspired by Stella's maximalist relief sculptures from late in his career. Make sure to add lots of colors in your design. Next, we're going to flip our paper over. Trace a few different round objects in overlapping circles and semicircles like Stella's Protractor series. Then add lots of color. Use a marker to make several dots around your paper and then draw wavy lines out to the edge. Try to do this at least six times. Then use scissors to cut along each of your wavy lines. Just make sure not to cut all the way through. Now it's time to make our project three-dimensional. For this step, you'll need tape or glue. Roll each loose section to the middle or opposite side and attach with your tape or glue. Continue this process until you have a sculpture. You can leave it like this or loop a string through it to hang it up. 